everybody it is october and it is the 19th i believe it's a wednesday and it's 2022 so i am outside in the front of the property and the mission today is to take the fencing down the old fencing uh, that has like electric wire or that didn't have electricity through it uh, to help stand up the blackberries because we're moving the blackberries as you probably saw in kevin's video back to the west part of um garden by the barn so what we're going to do is take these down and then this area will end up being um trees planted in here so hank is out here helping me it's a little chilly today we'll see how long hank lasts oh here comes timmy he's helping also so yesterday I started this project and I'm going to show you a little bit of it. So when we look, there are one, two, three, four, five, six, seven long rows. There's two shorter ones over there by the maple tree. And yesterday we got the three big rows done. And this morning, hopefully before lunch, we'll get the last four completed. And uh, walking down here, just to kind of show you what we're up to, is you can see where you have the T-post and the wire attached to it. So I have a nice cutter um, that I cut the wire and then um, the lower and the upper. See, there's two wires here, actually, here and here. And we'll curl it up. But first we have to take all these little ties off. Oh, Timmy just crawled right up on my head. Can you see him? He's helping. Oh, lordy. Thank God I have a hat on. Um, and because these are the type of ties that you can take off. You pinch this little thing and you can reuse them so they're not a waste. And then sometimes there's also little clips that we have to kind of help hold the branches up. So I will go down and get all these ties off and then roll up the wire. And of course, we will save that for some other projects in the future. So I have my little tools here and the handy dandy gorilla cart. So this is, um, the nice cutter it works great it takes two seconds to cut the wire and this is the wire i got off yesterday so i roll each one up and then i actually use the zip ties to go ahead and keep it um, together and then i have a bucket to uh, save the zip ties to use in the future and those are the little clips I was telling you about to keep the plants upright. And then I have an extra bucket over here because like the pieces of wire or any tape or anything that I find that we want to get rid of will be in that bucket. So I will get on with the project. We got Hank in the background. We got Timmy next to me here. So I have my assistants and we'll get these four rows taken care of so we can get these plants out of here and start putting some trees in. All right, <laughs> see you later.
right, I'm back and Timmy is crawling up me as usual. Um, just got done with all the fencing up here in the old blackberry patch and it's a little after 12 o'clock, oh, about 12.30 I guess, but Hank and I and Timmy got it all done. So now we just have the posts to take out. I tried wiggling them, but I couldn't budge it at all. So Kevin's gonna come along and maybe some equipment just to help pull it straight up. They've been here for years and years and years. And then we have the blackberry plants that are left. And I think he's gonna transplant them uh, back on the west side of the uh, garden. So, We'll continue with that. I'm sure he will let you know. So, it was great seeing you again, and you have a wonderful day. And take care and enjoy the fall time that we have now. If you like the video, give us a thumbs up and subscribe would be fantastic. Take care. Always good seeing you. Bye bye, you guys.